Be advised, the following video is brought to you by the Cornwall Lebanon School District Technology Services. Although the information is being presented in a silly manner, the technicians want you to know that it is 100% real and can be used by anyone, anywhere, at any time, with a Windows 10 PC. Several individuals have experienced the following side effects from watching this video. Sense of satisfaction. Feeling of accomplishment. Increased intelligence. Feeling like a technology wizard. Prepare yourself because you're about to learn some amazing techniques. Cornwall Lebanon School District Technology Services Hey, Chris and Dan here, and we have some keyboard shortcuts to share with you. What's a keyboard shortcut, you might ask? You might be familiar with the copy and paste shortcut. Control C for copy, Control V for paste. Those are keyboard shortcuts, and you can use them to navigate through Windows 10. Keyboard shortcuts can make using Windows 10 easier and quicker. But wait, there's more. Do you want to take a break from your laptop but don't want to close any apps or shut down? Go to the lock screen with just a simple keyboard shortcut. Press the Windows key plus L. When you're ready to tackle work again, just sign back in and pick up right where you left off. Super easy! Speaking of signing in, if you type in your password and you want to see if you entered it correctly, instead of clicking on that little eyeball, just press Alt F8. Ta-da! If you're like me, or me, and have a bunch of programs open and running at the same time, you probably get tired of having to reach for your mouse to switch between different programs. Well, we have good news for you. Press Alt plus Escape or Control plus Tab and you can cycle through all the current programs that you have opened. Another way to do this is to press the Windows key plus Tab. By doing this, you can see all your open programs and recent files that you accessed. Pretty cool, huh? Another cool trick is to toggle through icons on your taskbar. Press the Windows key plus T. Once you get the icon of the app you want to open, just press Enter. But let's get serious. All those keyboard shortcuts are too easy. You're an advanced Windows user, and you want to know some hidden secrets. We've got more to show you. Did you ever wonder if there's a way to access those tabs at the top of a Word document without moving the mouse to click on them? Well, there is. Press F10 and you'll see the invisible letter and number menu that is secretly hidden in most programs. Now all you have to do is press the letter or number that corresponds to the tab you want to access. Who needs that pesky mouse anyway? Let's say you have several programs open and want to view something on your desktop. Instead of minimizing every single program one at a time, just press the Windows key plus D. In the blink of an eye, you have access to your desktop. You can also peek at your desktop without minimizing any apps by pressing the Windows key plus the comma key. We have a few more shortcuts to show you to really improve your navigation skills through Windows 10. You're doing such a great job so far, you deserve a smiley face! And yes, there's, there's a, a shortcut, shortcut for that too! Press the Windows key plus period or Windows key plus semicolon. Select your favorite smiley face. Need to pause your YouTube video? Press the space bar and your video is paused. Press the space bar again to resume the video. Having trouble reading small text? Try Windows key plus the plus key to open the magnifier app and zoom in. Zoom in and see the world. Forget about those reading glasses. Those are for old people. How about this little trick? Alt plus F4 closes the current app you're in. Some apps like Word, PowerPoint and Excel will ask if you want to save your work before closing. No need to click the red X. Okay, we have one more shortcut to share. Do you use multiple displays and are tired of clicking and dragging and clicking and dragging your programs from one screen to the next? Use the Windows key plus Shift plus the left or right arrow key. This will move the active app to your second or third screen without that annoying clicking and dragging. Thanks for tuning in. 
We hope you can use at least one of these shortcuts to help you navigate through Windows 10. Forget about clicking and moving the mouse. It's such a waste of time. If you practice and master all of these keyboard shortcuts, you can successfully navigate through Windows 10 without using a mouse or touchpad. Your hands never have to stray away from the keyboard because you have the power right at your fingertips.